Hello everyone and welcome to my young and restless gossip channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Billy endangers Diane Kyle's alarm clock Phyllis acts like Cupid. In Geno City there will be some unpleasant confrontations and a matchmaking scheme, according to the Young and the Restless teaser video. Let's speak about what's coming up because some major stories are set to intensify. For starters, Daniel Romilotti and his ex-girlfriend Heather Stevens will have Phyllis Summers play Cupid. It appears like Phyllis will try to persuade Daniel to talk about Heather, but she will be aware that his ex-girlfriend is nearby and can listen in on their conversation. The sole purpose of Phyllis calling Heather is to hear Daniel's confession. Daniel will acknowledge that having Heather in town has confused him, so Phyllis will ask whether any past feelings were rekindled. The intention is to force Heather and Daniel to reconcile, but Phyllis' scheme will fail. Possibly Daniel will eventually deduce what Phyllis is planning and expose her for more of her typical trickery. Phyllis won't help herself here because she's looking for forgiveness and trying to shed her reputation as a con artist. However, Daniel will undoubtedly have trouble controlling his feelings for Heather, which can cause problems in his friendship with Lily Winters, Crystal Khalil. Kyle Abbott will believe Nikki Newman's summons to the ranch is to talk to him about a potential future at Newman Media. Nikki, though, will insist on talking about Kyle and what the hell he's doing with his life first. Nikki will use this opportunity to bash Kyle for having an affair with Audrey Charles and urge him to get back together with Summer Newman, a bot. Billy Abbott will determine he must be the one to oppose Diane Jenkins Abbott and defend Jabot while Nikki tries to wake up Kyle. Billy cautions Diane in the Y and R weekly preview video, The way I see it, there's only one person who's gonna do whatever they can to protect my family's business and you're looking at him. Billy's warning will surprise Diane, but he'll be determined to oppose her power over Jack Abbott and the family business. Nikki Newman isn't seeing the big picture in the Y and R stepmama drama. Nikki Newman isn't to blame because of the young and the restless. She is Victor's wife. She is the mother of Victoria and Nicholas. She will, of course, support them over everyone else, particularly Adam. Victor ventured to adore the son of a different lady, one who ultimately chose to pass away, making her flawless forever. But we're worried that Nikki is only evaluating the immediate problems without taking the big picture into account. Nikki Newman, support your guys. Adam has angered Nikki to the point of her perfectly coiffed hair. Her steps entreated Victor poorly. Her steps entreated Victoria poorly. Nick, Joshua Morrow, was treated poorly by her steps in, and he treats her crudely a lot. From where Adam is now standing, everyone has earned it, and we don't claim that he is mistaken. Adam has always been made aware of his outsider status by Victor's wife and kids. If you exclude the fact that Victor hardly recalls Abby's, Melissa Ordway, existence, he'd be Victor's least beloved child. So everyone has an excuse for harboring resentment. However, Victoria, Nick, and Adam are pampered knave kids. Nikki is the mature one, and we assume she is more intelligent. Backdraft, Y and R. Nikki believes that by ordering Victor to cut all relations with Adam, she is improving the issue. Why keep banging your head against the wall when his younger son will never understand all that Victor has done for him? Crown Nick and Victoria as your heirs and continue to rule over them as you have in the past. They won't respond in kind, contrary to Adam. The issue with it, though, is that Victor will always have hope for Adam. Not until the Harvard grad breaks and acknowledges that Dad is always right. Thus, Victor will never leave Adam behind. Victor will push back more forcefully the more Nikki pushes him. He'll become irritable, then grumpy, then yelling. He'll begin berating Nikki with his anger toward Adam. And that will spill over to Nick and Victoria, which is the complete opposite of what she wants to happen. Hook up, Nate and Audra. According to YNR teasers, Audra and Nate may still be working together. When Nate and Audra were employed at Chancellor Winters, they originally concocted their scheme behind Lily, Devon, and Jill's backs. Nate is currently working at Newman and having a relationship with the CEO, while Audra has made a concerted effort to pressure Victor into guaranteeing her a job at Newman y and R. But will they be content with leftovers from the Newman table, or will the two work together to obtain more of what they believe they are entitled to? Secret Lives of the Young and Restless Definitely that will take place. 
The only issues left to be resolved are when, why, and who finds out. On the one hand, it makes reasonable that Andra and Nate would want to keep their relationship private. After all, Nate didn't get his position by, you know, actually being brilliant at business-related things. He initially got there by being Devin and Lily's cousin, albeit neither of them had nepotistic offspring, and then by having a sexual relationship with Victoria. So why would he surrender that edge before it was absolutely necessary? Power couple Lai and R. Nate and Audra, on the other hand, are both very haughty. They want the entire world to know when they accomplish something clever. Despite their best efforts, they won't be able to keep their plans, both personal and professional, a secret for very long. They'll want the world to know as soon as they manage to fool someone, particularly if it means making the Newman seem bad for way they were treated. Those two serve as the archetypal examples of pride rising before a fall. Moreover, they were their own worst adversaries. They believe they are invincible. Victor hasn't yet shown them his most irate pants behavior. CEO of Nikki's demand, willing to interfere Phyllis. According to the young and the restless, Phyllis Summers lays a love trap. Nikki Newman makes an effort to separate Kyle Abbott and Audra Charles. Fans may also anticipate Kyle and Audra having to make a difficult choice regarding their illicit relationship. Discover what will happen next in the CBS soap opera by continuing to read. Teenage and the Restless, The Love Trap of Phyllis Summers. According to YNR rumors for Tuesday, September 5, Phyllis will set a love trap. Although some fans had speculated, Phyllis won't arrange a match for Summer Newman, Allison Lanier. Instead, Daniel Romilotti Jr. and Heather Stevens' reunion consumes Phyllis. Perhaps Daniel will admit something to Phyllis regarding Heather. Even though Daniel is seeing Lily right now, he wanted to see Heather again. Daniel's entire goal with the Omega Sphere project was to do that. Heather, though, asserted that she had moved on and found another man. Heather is suddenly having second thoughts now that Daniel is dating someone else. Lily Winter's fate in Woi and R. Speaking of Daniel, it appears that he won't be the only one who experiences conflicted emotions regarding a former partner. Fans can anticipate Lily to be uncertain about her future with Daniel on Tuesday, September 5. For Lily, seeing Daniel and Heather together can evoke conflicting emotions. It might even prompt Lily to consider rekindling her relationship with Billy Abbott. Chelsea Lawson, Melissa Claire Egan, who is now with Billy, is departing Geno City with Connor Newman, Judah Mackey. The Abbott hair grows bored easily, but Billy and Chelsea are determined to stay together despite their distance. Teenage and the Restless demand from Nikki Newman. According to other The Young and the Restless teasers, Nikki and Kyle will meet. Nikki makes a demand after discussing Newman Media Company. Kyle is told by Nikki to explain to her what he is doing with his life. Watch The Young and the Restless to find out what happens next. Nikki is undoubtedly referring to Kyle's relationship with Audra. Nikki was completely ignorant of the situation, let alone the divorce proceedings between Kyle and Summer. Despite Nikki's desire for Skyle to reunite, Kyle will explain why it won't work this time. In the end, Nikki will respect Kyle's choice. Nikki firmly believes that Kyle and Summer still stand a shot, however. Nikki will therefore give the directive for Kyle and Audra to avoid developing a romantic relationship. Y and R. It has been hinted that Kyle and Audra will need to make some choices. Both individuals want to keep their current occupations, but they also don't want to cease working. Kyle and Audra will therefore keep up their covert relationship until one of them makes a mistake that is. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.